when my pet frog turned out to be a giant African bullfrog. When I was 13, my parents took me to PetSmart to get a little tiny frog. I picked the tiniest frog that was like this big and I named it Lily. It didn't take long for Lily to start growing. It grew and grew and grew. We ended up doing a bunch of research and it turns out that Lily was an African bullfrog, which grow to the size of a football and live up to 40 years. Lily ended up getting razor sharp teeth and needing to eat goldfish and mice and her teeth got so sharp that she bit me. I still have a scar on my finger and my parents decided that it was probably time to find Lily a new home. My dad contacted the Virginia Zoo to see if they wanted an African bullfrog. They said yes. This is the last photo I have of Lily and I before we took her to the zoo to go to her new home. A few months ago, I was able to visit the Virginia Zoo that Lily has been at. It turns out that PetSmart told me the wrong gender. They're actually a boy and the zoo renamed him as Prince Charming, which is pretty ironic because he was so vicious. The zoo takes him on educational trips to schools and classrooms, which is just so cool. He's been happy on display and eaten good, and he's 14 years old now. The best part is that Doug got to meet him too. He was so curious, but also pretty intimidated. I never imagined that one day I'd bring my dog to meet the frog I grew up with. The whole zoo was so excited that Doug the pug got to come and that the OG mom of Prince Charming was reuniting with him. The funny thing is, I think he remembered me. He also literally peed all over me. <laughs> Follow me on here on Instagram to hear more fun animal stories.